Hi there, Leo, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of March the uh, 13th through to the 19th. I went ahead, shuffle the cards, lay them all out. Let's see what's going on for Leo. First up, we have the Nine of Swords reversed, followed then by the Six of Wands upright, the Two of Cups in the upright. Well, then by the cute little page of cups upright. And lastly, the six of cups upright. Holy cups. It could be an emotional week in a good way for Leo. Your overall energy is the nine of swords reversed. Okay, this is really good. Nine of swords in the upright. Mm, not so good. <laughs> could indicate a lot of anxiety, a lot of overthinking of a situation. This can um, come about when we're thinking about like multiple different things or we're trying to find a solution, looking at nine different ways to, you know, bring a solution to a problem can go, cause sleepless night great great anxiety when the card is inverted however this is where some resolution is being made even if it's just in your own mind leo some something is calming you down this week so it could be a resolution to the problem or perhaps you have found some solutions um, at least in your mind, it's like, well, I know I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that, and then that will take care of it. So you could be putting your own mind to rest, or perhaps the situation is resolving itself in a positive way and bringing, um, bringing the anxiety level down. Right at the beginning of the week, we have the beautiful Six of Wands in the upright position. This is victory all the way, baby. <laughs> this is where um, we're getting a lot of pats on the back. Maybe you've completed something. It could be a project at work, or even at home and people are taking notice of it and they're thanking you and and uh, telling you what a great job you did this is also the prodigal son or daughter returns it could be some of you are taking a trip to be with uh, family friends or people that you haven't seen in a very long time and they could be again just happy to see you and a lot of kudos to you next card up is the two of cups in the upright position this is beautiful very um twin flame soul matey kind of energy this is where we're making a connection with another human now this could be where we're getting together perhaps some of you are going on a trip somewhere and maybe you're going to hang out with your best friend and you guys are just going to have a great great time for others of you this could represent meeting someone who feels almost like an extension of you it's the meeting of the heart the mind and it's a beautiful soul connection uh, for others of you, it could be indicating that you and your spouse or somebody that you're dating are on the same page and you're headed in the same direction. So this could be you and uh, your spouse perhaps making plans together and realizing just how like-minded you actually are. Are. it could be where it feels like they're reading your mind it's like i that's what i thought we were gonna do i totally can't believe you're saying that same thing could be things like that going on <laughs> moving on towards the weekend we have the beautiful page of cups in the upright position it is a court card could be representing a person if it's representing a person this is water energy cancer scorpio pisces sun moon or rising sometimes pages can represent younger people children maybe grandchildren or so forth being incredibly sweet and just kind of making your day for others of you you could be hearing a message from somebody who just thinks you're the cat's meow and they could be uh, letting you know that they have a crush on you for others of you it could represent a very sweet and heartfelt apology or it could be some cute uh, little flirty notes from someone perhaps that you've just met and you had a connection with. If this is somebody new that you just met in the Two of Cups, this is probably them sending you the cute little messages. Um, they're trying to start something here <laughs> on the emotional friend. And the last card you have is the Blast from the Past card. The Six of Cups in the upright position. Well, this is, again, very soul matey energy. This is together. This is, like, pretty nice. So some of you could be making a connection or a reconnection to the past so, with someone from the past. Or it could be that you're meeting someone who feels like someone from the past. It's like you feel like you've always known them so if you guys are single this could be a great week for you to meet somebody new that you have such a strong strong 
heart connection or it could be somebody that you're reconnecting with someone from the past for others of you this could represent perhaps attending it is weekend energy maybe you're attending um, some type of get together or it could be um, a reunion of some kind and uh, perhaps you're just going to be enjoying playing remember when and uh, getting together and being happy with the the memories of the good old days i don't know how else to put it but don't forget to leave that comment in the comment section below and i hope you have a fantastic week leo thank you so much for joining me and i hope the reading helped you if it did please feel free to like share and subscribe and i'll see you again next week bye bye for now